Oh, look, I think it was great for both sides. You know, it was always going to be a good challenge, and uh, I thought we played particularly well. Probably copped an offside goal in the first half, but scored a very good goal, and I thought quite convincing in the second half. Well, we stressed last night at training that um, you know a, re a really solid performance by all the players was really important, and uh, you know we're close to announcing another side to go away in October, and uh, you know places are up for grabs. Oh, I don't think so. You know, I think it's great. You know, we've got a professional side, and it's good to support them. They're only a couple of weeks away from starting their season, so um, no, it's uh, you know I thought it was both for, for you know really good for both sides today. I mean, all eyes on the World Cup qualification. Yeah, I mean uh, November's not far away, so um, you know it's important. I mean these are just domestic guys, or you know majority here are amateurs, so um, they're striving to be part of the squad, and they didn't do themselves any harm today. Yeah, look, I think they were as surprised as uh, having to come out as we were just to probably see them, you know. Didn't think Mexico would be in the frame for uh, for a playoff. But yeah, look, they were very complimentary. I think they want to know a little bit a little bit about New Zealand, but um, not too many all whites on display today. Now, I mean, what does it say about the World Cup? Well, if we've got them, they're Mexico City on the 13th of November. So, um, you know, if they finish fourth in the group, that's that's probably the best that they could do. But very, very tough challenge. Respectful side and always done very well on World Cups. Oh, I'm sure they've come out to see it, but, um, you know, a little bit to go. And, uh, and like I say, 95% of the players aren't here anyway. How did the game go for you? It was a good head out. Um, it was good that Ricky and I got together. Good for the all way, certainly good for the Wellington Phoenix. How do you think the result of the What was the main aim of today's game? Well, um, we're going to lose the all whites probably in the first round against Brisbane Roar, so it gave the rest of the boys a bit of a run, but also it, it gave uh, Tyler Boyd his first game. It's, it's virtually a different back four, another opportunity for them to gel together. And uh, up front, Carlos hasn't been doing a lot of training recently, but he looks like he's he's getting back into it. Just not as fit as he should be at the moment. Oh, it was good. I mean, Ricky and I have competed many times in the A League. I think we're, we're the two longest service, serving coaches in the A League, so uh, it was nothing new to either of us. How hard is it going to be to um, to be with the international players at the start of the season? Oh, that's always going to be difficult, but we've got some good depth to the squad and. Uh, Looking at how Leo Bertos and Jeremy Brocky and Andrew Durante played, it, it means that when they do come back into the side, we're going to have a pretty strong side. Well, I mean, how's the game going for you? Yeah, I think it went quite well. I mean, uh, for the New Zealand A side, we came together yesterday, so 24 hours together, a short training session, and to come out here against the professional side that's been in uh, pre-season for a, a few weeks now, you know, and get a, a, a result like that, it's, it's a good effort from the boys. Oh, with the result aside, one month draw, but what was the main aim, really? Well, it was all about the application. You know, we got, the guys got together to uh, to see how they can apply themselves in the game, and and the boys really put a good effort in. I mean, some of the some of the team from the NZA are, are in pre-season now, so not quite fit. So, you know, the effort was there, and uh, you know, to get a goal away was, was a good result. I mean, is, it, is, it, is playing another New Zealand side or wearing all white jersey with the most great feeling? Yeah, it's strange. I mean, we're all supporters of the Wellington Phoenix. You know, we hope they do well this year in the A League. They've uh, put together a very good squad, so uh, you know we hope them uh, all the best. I mean, a lot of the, the boys in there are Kiwis as well, so uh, hopefully they do have a good season. How important was the result today? I don't think the result was too important. It was more about just the way the, the guys got together and played, and, and hopefully a few of them put their hands up for the uh, World Cup squad. That's the same last question. Are we on World Cup qualification? Yeah, I mean, that's the main aim, eh? It's coming up in November, so it's around the corner. So, uh, you know, a big, big few weeks for, for Ricky and the squad, and... And guys today, you know, put their uh, hand up and said, yeah, I want to be picked for that. So uh, the more players available for New Zealand, the better. Yeah, I mean, you know, if you've seen them, they've the seen them around the television crew, you've got from Mexico, doing a bit of a dump go about you guys, about New Zealand, because they think that you're going to end up uh, playing against them, they've been through New Mexico. I mean, you think they might be able to cook with you guys and you're getting a few uh, spying, spying the things up your sleeve? Yeah, totally, man. It's expected. I mean, uh, you know, Mexico is such a big nation in football that... There's so much interest here in football, so uh, you know it's no surprise that they've got a TV crew down here.